that please wait screen. You know the one that pops up when you try to open a PDF and it just sits there. It usually looks like this. I'm going to pull back the curtain and show you the workaround I'm using. It solved my problem of not being able to open these files or view them properly without changing my entire PDF setup or installing any unwanted programs. And the best part, it's online. These PDFs often come from government institutions like revenue services, banks and big corporates. Opening these files on a MacBook, well that's where things get tricky. Turns out, these aren't normal PDFs. They are something called an XFA type PDF. And that's where the problem begins. XFA PDFs were designed to be dynamic and interactive. Uh, which basically means most PDF viewers like Preview on a MacBook can't open them properly. The obvious solution seems to be downloading Adobe Reader. But what if you, like many Mac users, don't want to hand over your entire PDF workflow just to view one document? That's where this workaround comes in. It's fast, simple and turns that stack file into a normal working PDF hassle-free. It all started with the search XFA PDF to normal PDF and in brackets XFA form flatten. That led me to this website. It looks like the tool runs of Heroku's speed testing platform. But don't worry, what matters is that it works. Let me show you the full website address so you can take it down. On the landing page they say the app allows you to convert PDF with XFA form to a normal PDF. You can remove the XFA form in PDF via this app. So it looks like we're in the right place. You have options. Upload directly from your computer, Google Drive or Dropbox. I'm going old school for this test. Grabbing the file from my downloads and uploading it. There it is. Now I'll choose convert to normal PDF. The conversion process is surprisingly fast. And as you can see, this is happening in real time. Once done, I get a message that it's converted. And here's something useful. Before downloading, you can preview the file first. And I must say, it did a solid job. This is a typical SARS letter and all the information looks intact. I'm happy with that. So I'll close the preview and go ahead with the download. In my downloads folder, the new file looks almost identical to the original, but you'll notice the file name now ends with flatten. Moment of truth. Let's open it. And there it is, the SARS letter, now fully readable and working perfectly. A massive improvement compared to that frozen, please wait screen. That's another problem solved with the fun accountant. I am Louis Munro. Thanks for watching and remember, trust yourself. Your numbers will back you. Not every shadow.